Hello everybody, my name is RetroBio3, and welcome to part 9 of my Let's Play of the, of the iOS and Android port of the original Sega Genesis Sonic the Hedgehog. And getting right into it, here we are in actually the final zone of the game, Scrap Brain, Act 3. Oh, well, really, Labyrinth Zone Act 4. Good job, Sega. Apologize for if, if you hear noises in the background. That is my dog. at how this, for some reason, I'm doing a lot better than I normally do with this level. Wait. 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 That was it! It's usually way longer than that. Okay, fine. Final boss, then. I with, well, just the final boss of the original Sonic the Hedgehog for the Sega Genesis. It's not as cool as, like, the Death Egg Robot or Doomsday Zone or Perfect Chaos or really any Sonic on a final boss. This is probably, like, the second worst after Sonic CD, but, I mean, hey, at least it's something. I mean, it's, it's not a very cool something, like, he's literally in a cylinder, and it's just a... 50-50 chance of whether I'll even be in a place where I can hit him. Yeah. Well. Okay, so take two. By the way, I love the final boss music for this game. I don't know why. Okay, I have a game over. So now to just quickly get back into this, since luckily, yay, save states. Getting a game over means nothing. Wait, I'm just supposed to actually do anything to you? I never actually tried to run into it. I wasn't sure if it would kill you or if it would just be. I wonder if he has the same pattern every time. Okay, nope, it's random. Okay. Earlier, I wasn't saying that, I, that this was an easy boss, I was just saying that it's definitely not the best in terms of spectacle. I mean, heck, I mean, it's not even... I mean, again, it's kind of annoying how it's literally random chance, like, especially compared to Sonic 2's boss fight, which I would say is probably one of the best final bosses I've ever seen in a video game. 
And so it's just like you have to be so good at the game by that point to win. I mean, like, this is definitely, honestly, still probably the worst classic Sonic final boss, but definitely one of the better final bosses comparing everything in the series. But by the way, I'm super excited because as I'm recording this, it's actually only a few days until Sonic Mania comes out on PC. Also, when I'm releasing this, it's the same thing there with Sonic Mania. That's gonna be awesome. I can't wait. Come on. Okay, game over again. Okay, take, I don't know, six? I think this is take six. I mean, like, I uh, no. I mean, like, la I mean, like, the last actual full level had gone so swimmingly that I hadn't really thought that this boss battle might take up a ton of time. I apologize that I'm not talking much, I'm just trying to concentrate on the boss here. Well, I don't know if concentrate is really the right word here, since it doesn't... Again, it's not... It, it doesn't take a lot of thinking, it's just kind of... Be in the right place at the right time. Don't get squished. So this is the spot to hide, I guess. In this corner. And another game over. Okay. Go, Sonic. Go, gotta fast. Okay. Yeah, I think that that's kind of the strategy here. As soon as these come down, hide in this corner. And so far, it's working pretty well. Robotnik keeps coming to this side. By the way, to me, he is Robotnik. I don't know if I mentioned this, but this is America. I call him Robotnik. I know that technically he's always been Eggman, and he is Eggman, and he always will be Eggman, but no. He's Dr. Ivo Robotnik. Kinto boy. Something. I don't know. And that's why you don't hide on that side. Because you can't do any damage there. Yay. Okay, so yeah. 
Let's, uh, let's try to do it, do it this time. Okay, Sonic. Say that with you if you wish to do something cheap. That wasn't even a sentence using correct words. I can English it, don't worry. Yeah, I know I'm choosing this battle, but I don't care, because this battle's kind of random chance. Eggman's choosing it, I get to choose it. It's only fair. I realized that like a minute ago I, I mentioned how I called him Robotnik, and not, just now I called him Eggman, but don't ask questions. I think that that might have been hit number six or seven. Anyway, we're nearing completion of this boss, if I don't screw up. Yes, that- yes, we're- we beat him! Come on... Yes! And here we are, with an ending. <laughs> oh cool, here we have some credits. It's really weird to hear the Green Hill Zone theme played over Marble. Now the Labyrinth Zone in the Spring Yard. Why not? I guess you could jump off of there. I never thought about jumping off. My favorite. I'm a sucker for Starlight. These are some pretty nice credits. Like, they're simple, they just kind of show gameplay footage, but still, it works. Presented by Sega. Alright, we got the bad ending, I nearly forgot. So everyone, join me in the final episode of this series as we go back through the game and collect the other four Chaos Emeralds to get the game's true ending. So thank you all so much for watching, and I will see all of you in the next video. Bye-bye!